Hey there, all you romantic people of the internet. To Hatterful Boyfriend. So, there's too much strife, too much conflict, too much chaos. Not just on the internet, but in the world at large. So, we need to bring some peace and understanding. And, th you know, this dove... Is one of these a dove? They look like doves. They represent peace, happiness. And we're going to understand what it's like to be a young maiden. Being accosted by many... Well, I don't know about many, but... One of these gentlemen here. One of, only one of which is actually a pigeon, as far as I can tell. This guy, Matt, he kind of stands out a little. I don't know how he's thinking he's going to get away with this. I guess we shall see. So we shall begin our new life. At St. Pigeonations Institute. Hmm. Welcome to St. Pigeonations. Please enter your name. Your first name is... It is not Hiroko, I'm sorry. Hiyoko? Uh, what name would a young, vibrant pigeon find appealing? We need something that's gonna entice... What else? Oh, even better, actually. Uh, uh, sorry, I was gonna go Bredo, because Hiyoko... If we take, it takes place in Japan, but... Enter your last name, Tosak. Mm, close. Close. There we go, that will be our Japanese part. Bread toasto. Is bread toasto okay? you damn right it is. Uh, I clicked. Uh, yes. That's a full boyfriend includes a powerful visualization module, allowing even the birdiest of birds to appeal as normal humans when first introduced. That's useful. It'll help me relate to them even better. Display human portraits. I thought you said you were going to. Hmm. And why would I turn it off? Configuration saved. Did I choose... what? Why did I just choose that? I don't... St. Pigeonations, a school blessed with an extensive curricula and faci facilities. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. Wait, what was your ordinary life? I should probably say this school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's. No, the what? Greatest oh wait, this is a female, isn't it? This place is this place is Japan's. No, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports, all come to St. Pigeonations. Wait, so it is in Japan, so this is a real you know, a quote unquote real world phenomena. They have a school for pigeons. Okay. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. Oh, so this being called the Pigeon Dating Simulator is actually really misleading. I know it doesn't say that in the title, it's just that's, what every, that's how I was introduced to this game. I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. It's a long story. And every day, I guess, I, hmm. we don't know the gender yet, I guess. And every day I see you rushing along like this. Ryota! So I'm guessing this is one of the uh, the guy pigeons. So I'm, I'm going to write down what I'm... Good boy, so Ryota was that? Let's try and keep track of these, because I know when I've done visual novel games before, I always lose track of what voice I'm using. Uh, okay. No idea if this will fit the character, but here we go. Usually you'd have been ready for an hour by now, bread. Overslept. Whoa. Oh, okay, that's the human point. Yeah, this that fits him, I guess. This rock dove named Kawara Ryota. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. Wait. How long is a pigeon's lifespan? Because I'm trying to work out, like, we're human? So, barely ha- I mean, how fast do pigeons grow- take from hatching to actually being full-fledged adults? Like, a couple of weeks? Uh, what? I'm overthinking this a little too much, I think. Well, trying to overthink it. He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. 
breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Uh, that doesn't sound... What? You have red meat for breakfast? What happened to, like, Weetabix? Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. Oh man, this guy's smooth. I might take you up on that offer when starvation looms. Thanks, Ryosa. Oh, the bell already? Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers. No good being late on the first day. Jeepers. And so Ryota pulled me along into the school. Today's the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year. Better make up for that last fa- Wait, I thought you said you'd started this school this year. Uh, I'm already forgetting the storyline. Edible boyfriend. The most splendid and greatest academy. The pigeon, by the pigeon, for the pigeon. First term. Kind of like the look of that one on the left of the back. I think we're in two free. Ryota and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill fills my heart as I look around the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of many happy memories. Now that's a sentiment I can get behind. Oh, the teacher's here. Kazuaki. I'm gonna assume that's a guy as well. Kazuaki. Uh, what am I giving this guy? Okay. Good morning, everybody. Eh, uh, I'm Nanaki Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. I specialize in maths and physics, and also some other things. Being a, a bee? What? Sir, wake up, it's homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open. What a charming gentleman. This quail is Nanaki Kazuaki. It is famously so, so pure soporific math teacher I have no idea what that means you're famous for I'd heard the rumors but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that so he's got narcolepsy apparently he's well a well-known math apparently he's well known as a mathematician just goes to show great minds come in all forms even quails ah I'm sorry isn't it a little warm in here which reminds me we have a transfer student Please introduce yourself, Shimogane. Is that male or female? I'm just... I'm gonna assume male. If they've got a character portrait, it's probably because I can... I was gonna say get it on with them, but I hope it doesn't go that far. Uh, this looks like a... A prim and pop, proper bird, so... Sequoia. Um... Try and give her a Bowie voice. I said her. Him a Bowie voice. I said I don't know what a Bowie voice sounds like. Damn it. So I just go, what is the point? Oh, no. That was terrible. Okay, we're not going with Bowie voice. Uh, we're going with... Okay. What is the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do you think I'm here because I wish to be? Oh, well. I guess that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all then turn into kul kulaks and dissenters. Or when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shirogane? Dot, 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 dot. Shirogane la belle sequoia. Yeah, that's a fitting voice for this guy. It's a shame I couldn't do Barry voice. It seems this fa oh. <laughs> it seems this fantail is Shiragane Sequoia. Its feathers would make any birdie proud. It, wait a minute, is this going to be like My Little Pony and it's like oh, every pony and oh god. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Well, surely we'd be the most understanding of that if we're the last year's transfer. Sequoia sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me. 
I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Yeah. Trouble sounds pretty good. Lunch already? Today is slipping by so quickly. That reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Wait, you're gonna be fined. Like, how long's the summer? Like, six weeks? Where is everybody? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly anybody here. Huh? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. No, or this guy. Or not, a morning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Hmm, did you want something from me? Nageki. Uh. Uh. He left away. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him or I felt looking at me, but there's nobody else here. Are you sure? Hold on, Nageki, before I forget. Nageki. Yes, I don't want anything with you. It's the things you're carrying I'm, that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk t as if to say, hurry up and return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> They're a little too dense and I never finished them. Were you waiting for them all summer? Okay, this guy's creepy. He silent re silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood? I'm Toaster Bread, a sophomore. What about you? Da da da. Da 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 da. Y yeah. Da 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 da. Nagaki. Fujishiro. Nagaki. Freshman. Aw. Oh. Perk up, son. Fujishiro Nageki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Yeah, you've already said that. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. Yeah, I would be too if I was being forced to have this book. Leave me alone! He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. What was wrong with Ryota and the teacher? Okay, Sakuya is a bit stuck up, but... Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... Oh. You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Oh, cr uh, you, yeah. Uh, I'm running out of voices. Ah. Uh. Come on, Sequoia. What kind of thing's that to say to your own brother? After all these years. My brother, you must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Please, don't try to talk to me to again. I've no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey, wait just a... Music's pretty good. I like this guy's theme tune. I assume it's not Sequoia's. I guess even if we're in the same school, now what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just heard something, overheard something juicy. The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man Sa Sakazaki Yuya is Sakuya's brother? I wonder what the story behind that is. Well, really? You're after a hatterful boyfriend and you don't know how brothers are formed. Hmm. Hey. <gasps> you heard that whole thing, right? Oh, no. Okay, this is just... A mellow fiend. Oh, okay. Are you a friend of Sakuya's? <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to listen in on you. Uh huh? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> no sweat. I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. Oh god, I hate this guy already. <laughs> Why do you look kind of like the teacher? Ah, uh, no. This fun tail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I've never talked to him much before, but he's famous or infamous throughout the school. Everybody knows of him. <laughs> You're bread, right? H how did you? <clears throat> I know everybody here. Besides, you're the only human. Yeah, I guess that would kind of make me stand out. I forgot that. Yeah. 
I'm human, but I can communicate with birds, and I t apparently take up the same amount of... If not smaller than the birds. Like, he's kind of looming over me. Huh. A single puppy in a field of rye. Did you say you were a friend of Sequoia's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. That was ballistic. Wait. That's overstating it a little. We're in the same class, that's all. I'd never have thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. Aristocrat wannabe? He is an aristocrat, actually. The genuine article. In the flesh. He is? He's a bit of a pain, so... Good luck, mon ami. Adieu. He really is a noble bird. I've never heard anything about like that about you, you though. You met him like two hours ago. Probably a twisty business. That's all for today. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! Huh? Sir, where's Ryuta? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go see if he's still there. Now that I think about it, Ryota always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. Excuse me. Da -da 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 -da. Nobody's here? Help yourself. There's nobody sleeping behind the curtains and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence. Wait, you're a human! Well, I guess humans are kind of hunter-gatherers as well, to an extent. There's nobody here. You're a human! Why are you using no birdie? I guess, yeah, no birdies are here. I guess technically correct, but why are you using it? Ryuta? No reply. The infirmary is still empty. Weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think about it, I haven't been in here much before. Unlike Ryuta, I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa, they've got all kinds of drugs in here. Eflipotrifa, Lucio, Benazine, Benzanine. What do these even do? Uh. What voices do I have left? Uh. Good to find out. <laughs> God. I uh, had to go. Oh, great, it's the doctor as well. Da -da 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 doctor! I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. Hmm? Oh, yeah, this is the guy who was trying to fit in on the front page, wasn't it? No, thank you. What? I know this. What is this song? Why does this guy have licensed mu- well, I guess it's not licensed music, it's- This partridge is Iwamine Shu, the, lo the school doctor. He's rather creepy in person, and he has a bad reputation amongst the student body. Everybody knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with aspergillus piscatosis, or even worse things. Hmm. And I never even heard him come in the door. Ninja doctor? Okay, he's pretty awesome then. Even that, he was just standing there behind the door the entire time. We don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Do you need something? Hmm, I heard Ryota Kawara from 2 Free was supposed to be here. Him? He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come find me before going home? So sorry to bother you. Are we going now? <clears throat> oh, he turned into a ghost also. Ah. <clears throat> ah. Finally out of that den of evil. Ryota's has already gone home. What do I do now? We'll go home. Oh, I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, bird watching. Wait, birds watch over birds? I'd never thought about that. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in middle school, and it's always funny watching the birds hop around. <laughs> That's kind of mean. I think the club room is on the ground floor off to the side. A white dove is having a tantrum outside. San. Oh my god. Oh, but I haven't been writing down the names. Uh, Doctor... Uh, San now. What the hell can I give him? Oh man, uh... Cool, cool! 
This is an old pudding for a man. Cool. Akasan rejects it. It's a lie. A, a vicious falsification. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. That's pretty awesome. Can I join in? What? <laughs> hey, that's not very nice to the pudding. Puddings have feelings too. Wait, what? This is his human portrait, huh? So he's a guy masquerading in a pigeon outfit. This is Okasan. He doesn't really look like it, but supposedly he's a faint tail pigeon. I think. Either way, he's hyper. Cool. Okasan has suffered a deception most vile, a wretched betrayal. Betrayal? Cool. Okasan instructed that pudding he be provided for new members. But this is a new pudding. Ousted, scorned, betrayed. Dragged into the streets and shut by those he mo trusted most. It's squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. Wait, pigeons buy pudding from the store? What's wrong with it? Spare the jest, young lady. Alkasan used wing attack. It's super effective. Why, wow, it took how long? 20 minutes to get that Pokemon reference in? They'll ruin the day that crossed Alkasan. I'll have he'll have them flayed, hanged, shot at dawn, he will. Alkasan must now train to retrieve true pudding. Farewell. Brown. He's gone. He's a good runner, but what does pudding have to do with the tramp team? And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pigeon Nation. Wait, what happened to the other clubs? Huh. Well, that was day one.